Hi, I'm Maya. Welcome to my kitchen. After two or three days of cereal for breakfast, my children usually stage a protest and demand something better, but I'm always short of time in the mornings, so I discovered an amazing way to make pancakes in under 10 minutes using my blender. It's healthy, it's quick, and it's easy. Let me show you how. We're gonna take a few eggs and crack them right into the blender. Without blending those, we're gonna add a bit of sugar, and you actually don't need much sugar for these pancakes because the sweetness is gonna come from some overripe bananas. Sometimes I see these and feel a bit guilty. I don't know what to do with them at this stage. This is a good use for your overripe bananas. So we're just gonna peel these and throw them in there. You can use any kind of overripe fruit, by the way. If you have overripe pears, cut them up and throw them in. They'll make a great tasting pancake. Okay, we're gonna add a little bit of vanilla essence. And now, we're gonna go for our first blend. Okay, now we're gonna add a little bit of milk. And this is some nice natural almond oil. If your children can eat nuts, this is a very healthy oil to put in their pancakes. And pour that in. And we're gonna give it one more blend before we add our dry ingredients. Okay, I have here some gluten-free baking mix. It's just a kind of a rice flour blend with a little bit of a raising agent in it. If you're not gluten-free, use regular flour and add a teaspoon of baking powder to make your pancakes rise. And we're gonna add this slowly, so we're not gonna add it all at once, because we don't want our pancake batter to get too thick. Okay, looks like I still need a bit more. And here we go for our last batch. Now, I'm also going to add to these pancakes some chia seeds. This is a nice way to add fiber to your children's breakfast. Super healthy and doesn't taste really like anything in the pancakes. So you might as well sneak a little bit of fiber into their breakfast. Okay, so we've blended everything in this one single blender, and now I'm gonna pour it on the pan and you'll get to see what the consistency should be like. So we're gonna take some nice unsalted butter and just grease our pan. If you're gonna make pancakes for breakfast, use real butter. And then we're gonna pour this on and you'll see what it looks like. Okay, now we're gonna wait for these guys to cook on one side. It always takes longer on the first side and what you're watching for is you're watching for little bubbles to appear on the surface. That's how you know it's time to flip your pancakes. Okay, so I think my pancakes are ready to flip. And so what I'm gonna do now is let them cook on this side a little bit shorter than the first side. Probably about 30 seconds to a minute is all they need on the second side. There you have it, blender pancakes in under 10 minutes. They're healthy for your kids because they've got chia seeds in there for lots of extra fiber and you can use up your overripe fruit. I'm Maya, thanks for joining me. Hope to see you again soon.